Hey there Rebels, my name is Leilani and I'm here to introduce PHE or Peer Health Education and the super cool and important project that they've been working on all year. Um, so like I said, I'm talking about Peer Health Education or PHE and they've been working on a project um, around YPAR and that stands for Youth Participatory Action Research. They wanted to find a specific issue that was important to them on campus as well as important to other students. And they wanted to find out how to, how to bring about positive change around that issue so that everyone can experience a positive and healthy time here at SLZ. What we decided on was the style of the bathroom here at school. We shared our ideas and experiences with the bathroom in our groups and found that we all agree they need a lot of improvements. We want to know if other students felt the same way. For months, we've been collecting a series of data to improve our school bathroom for next school year. In the process of collecting data, we distributed a survey and took a series of images using photo voice to document what we see every day. We ended up getting a sample of 276 uh, surveys. Here are our findings. On a scale of one to five, one being, the, one being the worst and five being the best, the majority of students rated the school bathrooms a two. In addition, 67% of people stated that they did not feel comfortable using the school bathrooms and 42% agreed that the evaluation of bathrooms need improvement. We have also found that among females and males surveyed, 81% of females and 68% of males have experienced having to use the bathroom but didn't due to missing supplies and dirt dirtiness. More than half of students have reported feeling physical discomfort at some point due to not wanting to use the bathrooms in the state that they are in now. The top three causes to an unclean and uninviting bathroom are lack of supplies, people don't clean it often, and students just don't care, which leads to a filthy bathroom. And finally, 92% felt that improving the bathrooms were important to them. Some ideas to keep the bathroom clean are to clean up after yourself more frequently, make sure that there's supplies, and to keep the bathroom clean by posting signs and reminders. Some ideas to improve the bathrooms are to check the bathrooms more frequently to make sure there are enough bathroom supplies on a consistent basis and to encourage each other to help keep our bathrooms clean by posting signs as friendly reminders. The work we have done on this important issue is only the beginning, so let's keep the conversation going and work towards the bathrooms we all can feel comfortable using. We look forward to hearing any other suggestions or feedback you may have. Thank you for hearing us out and always feel free to swing by the Health Center for any questions you may have. Thank you. Goodbye.